Greetings, programs. This is Wretch. Welcome back to Bannerman. And we are starting day four, guys, and the plot has definitely thickened here. We're not exactly sure where the real battle starts and where the nightmare begins, or if it's all one and the same. But I'm really curious to see where our lone soldier's story is going to go, and I guess it starts here with Lord Crowley once again. Fine work. Damn fine work. Unfortunately, our little conquest has put us farther behind Randall's main force. How many casualties? Minimal losses. An overwhelming victory. Are we continuing upriver? Yes. I will lead the main force in pursuit. You will have a different task. What shall I do? A number of Randall's cowards fled the church as we advanced. I cannot afford them the opportunity to regroup and attack us from behind. You will take a small force and hunt down those that remain. Go now. So there's our orders. At least it looks like we're going to have um, some support at least. Yeah, it was quite the scrap, wasn't it? What are you doing? We got prisoners. Crowley wants them dealt with. Now I get to have some fun. Ooh. That's not reassuring. Yeah, I'll be coming with you to take the catacombs. Some of the lads will be joining us. We've got to get them ready. Talk later. Hello there, target dummy. My only friend. Well, no, actually, that guy's... He's... This is our second closest friend. Practice those skills. Like so. Punch, punch. Regular attack. Kind of have to get used to all of this every episode. Definitely have some uh, stronger dummies this go around. And that will be our... Easiest victory today. The catacombs. Never a good thing to hear when you're playing a video game. Doesn't matter what you're playing. If you have to go to catacombs, normally, horrible, horrible thing. And I assume that's going to lead to a shortcut. So let's head down here first. Here lies Brother Kingsley, Keeper of the Faith. Interesting. And there's a portcullis over here. A treatise on combat techniques. Yeoman, or Yeoman, I've never heard, really heard that out loud. Carry twice the number of arrows for the longbow. Or... Um, Skajborg? Shields now have double durability. We are going to go with that for sure. Especially against the archers, which I think are going to be in very large amounts. By the way, you may notice that the sound is different than the last episode. I'm just kind of experimenting with different stuff. Please let me know if uh, this sounds a little bit better. Because I know that the sounds and music in this game can tend to drown out over time. Lady Dalton, to live in the hearts of others is not to die. Now I'm really curious what we're going to be finding over here. Probably dead ends. And hopefully not us dying. Hearing some really ominous sounds. Lord Walmsley, resting where no shadows fall. I'm wondering if we're going to fall through the floor here. Oh, Lord. No cave-ins, please. That would not really be high on my list of activities. Would be nice to find some armor, though. 
We are currently without. And this looks different. This actually looks like a living space. Howdy. Gotcha. Oh, you're about to get me. <laughs> Just have to follow that shield. I think once we're able to pull that off, we'll be in good shape. That was a very long table. Oh lord. Uh huh. That's right, you better run. Now let's not go chasing, let's keep exploring. Here lies Sister Abney. Our little angel. Hmm. Oh, this doesn't look good. Hmm. Oh, hi, Biggin. Haven't we met before? Woo! No joyous, uh, music this go around. Oh, and the higher. Oh, this is not the... <laughs> that was not the guy to get cornered by, was it? And that looks somewhat provocative. And back to the catacombs. Well, at least we know where to go. Now, this time... Let's try... Ah, this was the shortcut. Alright. So we were going the right way. Would have been nice to have had some arrows or something, but that is not how our luck is going to go. And I'm going to assume we don't need to read all of these tombs again. We'll just keep on keeping on. Fortunately, the catacombs seem pretty cut and dry. Not a whole lot of uh, twists and turns as of yet. That could always change, though. And this may be one of those times where we just won't have any armor. And that's the area that was blocked off. Probably we'll find a switch over here. Okay. That's one shot. Woo! Close. Now then. Mm-hmm. We're just going to kill you dead. And we know there's nastiness in that door, so let's see if we can track down some armor before we continue on. Hi! Well, actually, that might be a base where we can get something. Hold up. We'll head this way. Okie dokie. Can we go... Oh man, they move fast. There you are. We brought you a present. You're welcome. What's the situation? Found a couple of these rats up here. Took care of them. Keep moving below. We'll stop anyone trying to jump you from behind. I have to keep moving. No mercy. Oh, thank you for that wonderful present. And... Back we go. We'll have a rematch with the uh, tall shirtless one. So it was actually a really good thing. We need to kind of watch his movements and get accustomed to him again because I see that spearman down below us. 
Like, life is going to be very unpleasant for us if we have to fight the Spearmen directly afterward. Okay. So. One, two, and then he'll lunge, like so. Mm. Yeah, keep backing up. I don't mind that at all. Woo! Owie. Oh, this is not good. Not good at all. Especially if he keeps knocking us down like that. Man, he is relentless. Let me go ahead and head back there. Third time's the charm, maybe? I think we just need to keep the pressure up. Back up. Two. Yeah. We just need to keep him in that... That round that he's doing there. One. Two. And then counter it. Oh, I can't dodge anymore. Oh, it's not good. I Still got him, though. Took all of my armor. Oh, we got a crow's cage. Brother Fairburn, remembered with a smile. That's how I'd like to be remembered. I don't know about you guys, but... I think that would definitely not go amiss. Now we're heading down, aren't we? Oh! And there's a bow and arrow just mocking us. And it looks like we have an archer and a spearman right there. So, this'll be fun. Can we discuss this, guys? Please and thank you. Gonna get the spearman. Gonna lead him back here so I don't have to deal with the archer. There we are. Owie. Curse you and your fast moving spear. There we are. So was that just the appearance of a bowman? Huh. Now, one thing I would like to do is we pulled that and a gate opened up. One thing I am curious about before, well, hold on a second. And another gate just opened. So, I'm curious if this leads to that other gated area that we saw before that didn't look like it had a switch or anything, and I'm pretty much just stuck. And you see the, that ghost? See the guy that just formed right there and then disappeared at the bottom of the screen? What is going on here? I wish I could practice with the bow a little bit before we could needed to really do anything. There we go. Sword and shield. That is what I definitely would like. There's that. And sounds like someone's playing a, uh, some sort of stringed instrument. Go through all the gates here. I think I hear the blacksmith in the distance. Oh, it's just you. Aha! Spear versus shield. Who will win? Oh. No, don't you try and 
beer butt me. Shield bashing is for the win. And didn't have any damage to our shield, fortunately. And I always feel compelled to try and walk through those walls. Hello, hello. Not every day someone pops out of a tomb in front of me. A smith in a graveyard? The wagon threw an axle. Horse bolted when this fighting started. I'm stuck here for now. I've always hated that horse. Can you repair my armor? Alright, let me have a look. Montage. There you go. Good as new. I better get moving. Well, don't let me keep you. Now, what is over... Is this the shortcut? Ah! Hallelujah. Now, I'm going to head back down here because I... Whoa! Hold on a sec. Yeah, that was that area where we got the armor in the first place. So we're down one health, but we have two armor to help soften that blow. Remember, we couldn't head back to this area. Because of a gate. Whoa! Hi! This actually may have been the area. One shield bash. Ooh, that's not how that works. Effective. I like it. Oh no, there's that gate. It's still very much locked. Hmm. Alrighty. Well, I was curious. We'll just uh, keep on keeping on. I hope I don't miss anything vital. I probably did, knowing me. Shortcuts really cover some ground. Now we'll just head here through the tall grass and the hung folks in the background. And what's down here? A door that obviously will not shut on me. Oh, more armor. Huzzah! Well, this level has had a uh, less amount of nightmares than we are used to. Though that could always change. Indeed. So what are we fighting now? Oh lord! Um... Woo. What the? Oh! So you have to dodge it like a... Like an archer? So, there are supernatural aspects. I, I know that glowing purple sword could, should have been a clue. I can't just power attack anymore. I've got to cut through all these guys, at least attempt to. Owie. Is that all you're going to do? Oh. Yep, that's... You broke me. Yeah. I can't do anything now. <laughs> they made me T-1000. Well, at least we've got the catacombs. Or at least we got the shortcut now. So, let me go ahead and travel that direction. So, good news, bad news type of situation. Um, good news, I've got my armor, or at least a little bit back. 
bad news. The only way I could get the bow, because I think the bow would probably be a lot more useful here, and the rest of my stuff is to go through the entire level again um, without really using the shortcut. So I think we're just going to try and punch our way through this. You and your wizardry. Ow! And your Hadoukens. Woo! Oh! I see. Kind of. There we go. Gotcha. Just had to get in close, because that's the best way to fight a wizard. One more. Huzzah. You just cannot give them any ground. You just have to charge face first. You give them any breathing room, that's when they'll use all the spells on you. Whew. Alright, well, round two went better. And another signpost, meaning that it is the end of this day. So there is sorcery in this world. I thought it may have been kind of a nightmare thing with the purple sword, but... Oh, wait a minute. The nightmare is here. Of course. How silly of me. Definitely looks greener and more pleasant than we've seen, but that could change at any moment. Hi, how are you? Can't interact with any of the ladies. Hello, ladies. There's our blacksmith friend. Uh, my lord! We, we didn't expect to see you back so soon. Welcome home. My lord, huh? This guy's experiencing just everything. Like all kinds of different lives, it seems. How is it possible? I never thought I'd see you again. What's the matter? Aren't you happy to see me? Whoa, okay. Well then. You're not looking yourself, mate. Why? Don't let me keep you. You're a busy boy. Busy, busy. The nights are woven. We'll see them through. A hundred men now. We'll go on and see it through. Ugh. Let's keep it going. I'm sure we'll find all of our friends. You missed breakfast. It was double rations this morning. Here, yeah. help yourself to mine. Oh. Lord Crowley was asking after you. You're a lucky little boy. I can't move past him. At least he didn't explode into unpleasantness. And can't go that way. Oh, dear. Wake up! And 
and welcome to day five, guys. Wow, if I was sleeping like this, I definitely would be in a much worse <laughs> or temperament than this guy seems to be over the course of the game. But we will go ahead and end it here and uh, see what the day holds in store for us next time. Hope you all have enjoyed it. If you liked the episode, please leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, that'd be a big help. And we'll see you next time. Later days, everyone. <laughs>